the next concept is elastic fatigue what is the meaning of this concept suppose take an iron rod or any metal rod try to apply the force in a form of hammering that means there is a continuous supply of the stress on the body so if you hammered a body continuously repeatedly there is a possibility for the loss of elasticity for that body but this loss is temporary not permanent so due to the continuous stress applied there is a chance for the temporary loss of the elastic behavior of a body this is called elastic fatigue the temporary loss in elastic behavior of a body due to the continuous applied stress we are saying it is a temporary loss not permanent loss that means what are the examples for this concept take an iron rod which is bend bending of an iron rod bending of a metal rod once it is bended after that it automatically comes to the original state by applying the external force in the opposite direction for one time there is no possibility to behave the elastic fatigue means there is no change in the elasticity but if the bending taken place regularly means repeatedly then the breaking stress is applied on the body and the bended part which was continuously deformed and it will be removed from the original that means breaking of the object will takes place for one time there is no change in the elasticity and there will be no loss in the elasticity of that material but if it is repeated there is a possibility for the complete loss or permanent loss in the elastic behavior because the body was deformed completely it break it it's so a broke this is called elastic fatigue next one which is exactly opposite is elastic after effect in the previous concept we have seen temporary loss in elastic behavior that means automatically the body will regain its elastic behavior but this regaining for, for some objects this regaining takes short interval of time for some object will take large interval of time so this elastic after effect is called in a duration of time the ability to regain the elastic properties is called elastic after effect the ability to regain the elastic behavior in a course of time is called elastic after effect see the examples quartz crystal nowadays we are using the wrist watches all are with the quartz technology the quartz crystal comes to the elastic behavior very quickly while a glass takes lot of time quartz short interval of time glass takes lot of time so like this we can understand these two 
concepts but some objects no possibility to regain the elastic states because of the complete stress they will be in the permanent deformed state if you like this video please give a thumbs up please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on cbse syllabus